Hi there guys and welcome to Matt Bajewski YouTube channel. I'm just back from uh, a beautiful um, couple of days in uh, Munich, um, overloaded with uh, amazing, um, actually I, I went a little bit crazy, I, uh... <laughs> yeah, anyway, to suffice to say that my website will be uh, completely overloaded with the most beautiful crystals in the next year. Um, I begin work, obviously I've I've got so many crystals that I've been working with for the past six months so they, I'll keep uploading uh, crystals on the website as I've finished with them, uh, or Moldavites as well. So it's been a, a very productive, sorry I've got boxes everywhere because many, many things are happening right now. Uh, and we've got lots of launches, uh, yeah lots of new products, it's all going well, really well, markbayeski.com has never been, uh, I, in fact I was only, I had tears in my eyes last night thinking how lucky I've I've been in these past few months. Um, this YouTube channel now is nearly hitting thousands of subscribers every day, um, I don't know why, I, I really don't. I asked my friends I, I, what, what what's happening uh, I, and it's like this is all new to me because this kind of world I've been working in, but I had no idea, you know, as uh, I'm not tech, I have got no sort of technology brain or anything. I don't, you know, I can just barely, you know, post and things like that. So I'm learning every day, but I kind of smiled to myself and looked up and said, thank you, because technology surely must be coupled with the, the gift of spirit help, uh, helping hand by, you know, allowing people to find their way to a certain place and a certain message. So I do believe the bigger picture is that um, their message, their message is now being shown. Uh, it's being shown to the right people. It's it's shining bright now for all the right people. So, you know, it's difficult because, you know, I kind of feel, part of me feels like this is my baby, you know. And it's not really, because we don't own anything, you know, none of it belongs to us, we just borrow it for the time we're here, so the YouTube channel isn't mine, it just belongs to Spirit. Um, and I'm just somebody who just works alongside them to help them with their journey. Today's message is, um, again, quite profound, and it's about neglect and balance. I'm going to start with the bigger picture. We come into this world to experience many different feelings, many different thoughts, many different um, challenges and tests. But ultimately, it's our experience. Now, some may perceive that as uh, selfish. Others may perceive that as actually the path that I'm on. Along our way, we tend to um, sometimes forget about um, the balance. So you can all of a sudden meet somebody and focus fully on them completely and forget about you. Um, I'll give you some for instances. I'm a, a classic example of many healers, Reiki masters, pranic healers, uh, Ayurvedic teachers, massa masseurs. When they start a journey, they get so excited because they have this inner knowledge that, oh, this is why I'm here. You know, like we're all chasing, not the dream, but we're all chasing why we're here. We call it a word, the dream. You know, what is the dream? The dream is inner peace and to find our vocation, who we are. So we're all chasing that dream. <laughs> and we don't know why, and we don't know how, but we know something feels like, we, and then when we get a taste of something, which is normally when you find that, um, this might sound weird, but right, when, when you feel job satisfaction, when you feel like you've done something worthy for others, that's made them smile, that's normally the key, okay? But there is a dilemma in that, and the dilemma is that you get so enthralled, so excited, that sometimes we neglect what we maybe shouldn't have done. <laughs> a businessman who chases money neglects his family and his wife. A mother who tends to, his, uh, to her children neglects herself. Uh, an actress 
who chases fame. A healer who just wants to help neglects family and sometimes friends and sometimes becomes so isolated. You can go on and on and on, but you see where I'm coming from. Everything in life depends on balance. Why are we here in this world? If it was all about chasing the dream, why is it that things can get so painful and we can make so many mistakes? I think my message today would be, whatever you do in life, it's okay to feel that passion and drive to do something and to put 100% and to be committed in it. In fact, I can't stop you from it. Nobody can, not even your love or your family. But maybe if you're watching this today, guys, you might have to go through that path and then one day look back and say, wow, yeah, I did neglect. So then there's another side of this story. There's, there's always a, another side to everything. There's sometimes three sides, right? <laughs> I like the expression, your side of the story, your side of the story, and then the truth. And then I say, what is the truth? Because this person's truth is different from this person's and my perception's different. So what is the truth? <laughs> the truth is only what you think it is, but it can be completely different for everybody else because they see it from a different perception, a different angle. Hey, I saw you doing this. Really? Did I do that? Yes, you did. You see, we see things differently. So, the other side of that is that whoever is with you, their perception of what you're going through and what you're doing could be quite painful for them. And sometimes they can feel neglected, which in truth is so. But there's always a bigger picture, guys. And that bigger picture is that if we're brought together with somebody, then surely our path is twofold. One, to find our path and what we're meant to do. And the other one is to support whoever we're with. You know, there is a... There is something that I've seen quite predominantly over the past 12 years within many people. And that's the energy of um, what's in front of them and they can't see it. You see... In relationships, when somebody is there, loving, kind, caring, sometimes the partner never sees that and they're looking for something else and never really understand till after what they'd lost. So when you start to look at neglect you have to look at it on a personal level with one person at a time and how they feel and what they want in life nothing is ever personal nothing ever but yet we can feel it is in truth if you're watching this today I would say to you the most important thing about your path is your journey, balance, and your deep understanding of everything that you see in and around your life. Anything that feels weak inside you, anything that feels or brings out fear inside you, is that what you need to strengthen? It is never 
a partner's fault. It is never somebody else's fault or something out there. It's something within us that we have to strengthen. And it is not selfish because you are here to live your life. You are here to conquer all the tests and challenges along your journey. This is your path. And whoever and whatever you do in your life, you do it with the utmost of balance. And predominantly it's all about you in the end. Because when you move into the light, you are the one to look at your whole life and what you've been through and what you've done. So now ask yourself this question. If you were to move into the light tomorrow, is there anything that you wish you would have conquered in your life? Is it jealous thoughts? Is it sadness because you lost somebody in the spirit world, like your mother and father, your brother, your sister? Is it because your pain and suffering of a pet that you loved so much is gone and you can't feel them again? Is it because of your fear of your life, of the unknown, of the future? What is it that holds you back and puts fear into you? What is it that keeps you frozen in life? If you can at least try and find one of those things and work on it, then I would say welcome to my world. This isn't a personal attack on you by anybody or any dark forces. This is just simply you experiencing your journey and what you chose to experience before you came into this world. I want to experience how to love myself and be on my own and be happy with myself. So everything that happens in your life, you may lose the person that you loved to then honour that path that you chose before you came here. I want to experience jealousy and learn how to conquer it. So you start a business or your brother or sister does very well and successful and you don't. How do I conquer that? There are so many reasons why we come into this world. But let me tell you, you have the power and you chose these things to conquer and you will conquer them. You will and you will look back and you will say to somebody one day if they ever go through the same thing, how you conquered it and how you became stronger than that very thing. It isn't a slap in the face to feel the way you do. It isn't awful. It isn't really bad. You haven't done anything wrong. You're not weak. It is just a feeling. It is just an energy that you have to become stronger than. And trust me, it is simpler than you could possibly imagine. Your mind tries to fool you every day, but your heart whispers every day that you, my angel, are stronger than any given situation or feeling that enters your mind at any given time. So today, make a start, let go, accept this journey, and hopefully these little words today may have helped you understand that my beautiful friend, it is nothing personal, nothing personal. No matter what or who is in your life doing what or however you feel in your life, it isn't personal to you. There is nobody here to hurt you. It is only a test that you are about to grow stronger than. I love you with all my heart. I hope some of this made a little bit of sense. I'm not sure, but I tell you this now. I am growing stronger every day. I really mean that. And I'm really saying thank you for everything that I've been through. Why? Because I feel stronger. <laughs> it really is part of my journey and yours. Once you become stronger than anything that holds you back, you become amazing. <laughs> you'll get, you'll go home one day and go, yes, I did it. I don't need to come back again. I don't need to go back there again. <laughs> Why do you think things keep repeating? <laughs> oh, this keeps happening. I keep meeting this person. I keep meeting that person. I keep going into business with this. I keep, everything goes wrong. Yeah, it'll keep happening till you conquer it. <laughs>
<laughs> That's how it works. <laughs> so today, my dear friends, conquer away. Climb your mountain and remember, happiness is not a destination. It's just a simple way of life. Enjoy your journey. Stop often and look around you and realise how lucky you are. And work on your health. Work on your emotions. If you have no fear in your heart and mind, you will heal instantly. Have a lovely day, guys. And thank you for subscribing to Matt Bayeski YouTube channel. Love you all. Sun is shining now. It's because you're smiling. <laughs> Love you. Love you with all my heart. Have a great day, guys.